Hey, what's up everybody? I have a short video for you guys today and it's a follow-up video to the last one. The last one was Surface Rough Parallel. This one is going to be finishing up these angled surfaces. So we're going to verify this one. Quick play. So a short recap is we basically roughed this entire thing, then roughed out those surfaces. Now we want to finish those surfaces. So we want to go to the flow line toolpath and simply click on those surfaces that we want to machine. Okay. We'll change the uh, cut direction. That works. And really we can start from the bottom or top because we're only taking out 10,000 since we already roughed it. Speeds and feeds are already set. We'll go to distance type in 3 thou corner radius is set so go down to gap settings and tangential line length will put at 300 I like to go a little bit past the radius of the tool so this just means the tool path will extend past the surface 300 thou which I think it helps it clean it up a little bit better Okay, so it looks like it generated the toolpath. We'll backplot it. So yeah, 3,000 step overs, machining back and forth across that surface with the radius engaged will give us a really nice surface finish. And it's only taking out 10,000 instead of being engaged by, you know, a full inch of stock. So there's going to be no deflection of the tool. We'll go to verify so we can see in more detail what's going on. We'll pause it. We'll slow it down. And we will put on the compare. We'll give it will give us a plus or minus ten thou tolerance. So as you can see, it's moving back and forth across the surface, machining away the extra stock. And with a three thou step over, and with it only engaging in ten thou stock, it's gonna give a really nice finish. So this is really more of a finishing tool path. It can be used as a roughing one but I like to use the surface rough parallel as my rougher and the flow line as my finisher. So it's really just that simple. All you have to do is click on those surfaces, click a cutting direction, and make sure you verify it so it's not you know cutting into anything you don't want it to. And uh, and it's just that easy. So um, subscribe for more videos, and uh, we'll see you later. Thanks.